You've seen the TV show and you've probably heard a horror story or two, but are you one of them? Are you one of those mean, crazy, selfish brides that's flipping over tables and doing crazy stuff during the wedding planning process? If you're in the middle of your wedding planning and you think you're headed down that slippery slope, stay tuned because I'm going to tell you three signs that you are turning into a bridezilla. Hi, I'm Thais. I'm a wedding and event planner and owner of Marigold Rose Events based out of Baltimore, Maryland. Consider me your wedding warrior, helping you slay your wedding planning goals and helping you navigate through the big bad world of wedding shenanigans. Subscribe to my channel for free professional wedding planning advice that will take you from frazzled and frustrated to relaxed and in control. So let's jump right into today's topic. Three signs that you're turning into a bridezilla. Sign number one, you're not yourself anymore. I've encountered a few brides over the years who were so sweet and happy and in love at the beginning of the wedding planning process. And then about midway through, I didn't even recognize them anymore. If wedding planning is taking you out of character, there's time to make a change. If you didn't know the difference between teal or turquoise before you started planning your wedding, and now you're flipping over tables and cussing out bridesmaids because they don't know the difference either, it may be time to take a step back and get a reality check. Sign number two, you're not even having fun anymore. Wedding planning is supposed to be fun. It is a party after all, and it's a party to celebrate you and the love between you and your fiance. All of these precious moments should be treasured. Trying on dresses, going to cake tastings, picking up rings, spending bonding time with your mom and your sisters at your bridal shower. Don't take these moments for granted. You only get one time to plan your wedding, well, hopefully in your lifetime. So if you're not having a good time and you're finding yourself full of rage or sad or depressed or angry, it's just time to stop. Sign number three, you wanna kill your fiance. This is not a good sign. You're supposed to be enjoying your engagement, picking out furniture for your new home, picking out rings, planning your honeymoon, or just basking in the glow of your love for each other. If you want to hit your fiance in the head with a frying pan because he said he didn't care if you pick roses or peonies for the bouquet, you might be turning into a bridezilla. Remember, the wedding is just one day, but your marriage is a whole lifetime. Your fiance might not really be into wedding planning, but guess what? He's really into you. That's why you got that ring on your finger. So tell me, are you turning into a bridezilla? Or maybe you know someone who's turning into a bridezilla. Let me know in the comments below and maybe I can help you turn things. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope it was helpful to you. My main goal is to help brides and grooms make well-informed decisions during the wedding planning process. If you have a wedding planning problem that you're having trouble with, drop me a line in the comments below and maybe I can help you out. You might see your wedding planning problem solved in a future video. If you like what you see here, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can get all of my free wedding planning advice and also give me a thumbs up for this video. Thanks again and I'll see you next time.